some of those skills. And, and again, that was obviously something we discussed in Oslo. I mean, those are the kind of skills we need access to because, I mean, this is a world where it's a world of ideas, it's a world of free-flowing information and communication of both those ideas and information has become critical. It's a specialist skill. So, you know, we're not going to expect that specialist skill to be deeply embodied in a, you know, a climate modeler. Um, so I think it is another skills base that, that is, is necessary that we need to pull on board. But I think there's a whole range of those new types of skills. As I say, you know, just purely understanding the way humans receive messages, you know, that's a whole new body of, of research that we've got to draw on board. So, yes, of course, you've got to have the killer graphic. But what happens when that killer graphic goes through my visual center and I respond to it as a human? We've also got to understand that uh, value chain of, of communication. So I not only want you know, the, the great comms people um, to be accessible to us, you know, the people who are going to produce the killer graphics, but I want us to be reflecting in our assessments on that science of communication, on that science of understanding, because that's really going to be the key. Because at the end of the day, we only bend that curve. If you and I have an intention to change the way we live in this city, whatever city we live in, if you know, we, we change our aspirations. So the question is, you know, what, what impacts on us? And so I think there's a whole body of science as well around that that we need to start looking at and drawing into to our assessments.